All right, guys, I just wanted to show you my setup for the waterproof floating quadcopter. Basically, the GoPro goes in there, and then that's my FPV cam, that little camera right there. That's all sealed up, that way water doesn't get in. And as far as this goes, this is a uh, aluminum heat sink basically and super glued right underneath that is the ESC. That way all that heat dissipates outside without letting any water in. That's the motors, motor wires and that's all sealed up also. That way it's all, it's not going to let any water in. And I'm spinning 12 inch uh, HQ, HQ props with Sunny Sky Motors and they are 580 kV. Just gonna give you a side view here. I have the NASA GPS right there on some foam. And a quick look on the inside. Again, everything is sealed up. And that's my FPV antenna right there. Fat short towards the back. And this is my radio antenna. And I'm running uh, 40 amp Skywalker ESCs with a 5000 milliamp 4S battery that's about 25C discharge I'm getting about 10 minutes of flight time with this um, this frame flies really well there's not a lot of flex the only thing though is that these arms are so wide that I think it's inefficient when the prop is spinning it's catching some of the air right here kinda of pushing it down so that's you know with this setup on a regular frame, motors, props, battery and everything, I should get a lot more flight time but with this frame being as wide as it is in the arms, I'm only getting 10 minutes. But like I said, it flies great, I don't have any problems with it. Lands on water, everything is nice and dry inside after the flight. And no overheating issues as long as you do this setup over here. I think you'll be fine if you don't do it, but I figured, hey, might as well do it just to be safe. Last thing I want is for this thing to be flying out over the ocean and then one of the ESCs give up because of overheating issue. And then you just lost your rig. Alright guys, so if you have any comments, uh, questions, just uh, comment down below. Let me know what you think, and if you like the video, please subscribe and thumbs up. Bye.